The Swiss have given us many great things, exquisite timepieces, decadent chocolate, beautiful blondes, and some outstanding firearms. The Brueger & Thomet APC-9 Swiss-made masterpiece features exquisite quality in machining and craftsmanship, decadent ergonomics and controls, eye-catching good looks, that combine for an altogether outstanding firearm that is in a class with only the top quality firearms of all time. Just telling you that this gun is quality and the machining is amazing doesn't do it justice. You have to pick it up and feel it for yourself. The tolerances are so tight between the bolt carrier and the receiver that you would almost think that it is riding on ball bearings. Everyone that had the opportunity to shoot this gun while we were reviewing it was completely blown away by the quality. Smooth as glass, slick as grease, these metaphors just cheapen the experience that you get from the APC-9 and don't nearly do the firearm the justice it deserves. Fort Worth Colt Guy compared it to a Colt Python in overall build quality and function, and I think that's the best way to think of it. It represents the absolute best in its class and can be put in the same class as legendary guns like the Python, a Wilson Combat 1911, or a Sig P210. All of these guns are super tight in their machining while not sacrificing function. They all go beyond just being a functional firearm and bring the firearm to a higher level, almost taking the firearm to a work of art. I can acknowledge the fact that I have some deep, sick MP5 fetish. And the first step towards recovery is admitting that you have a problem. But if I take a step back and just look at these two platforms on their attributes alone, I would have to say that the APC-9 is superior in design to even my beloved MP5 platform, as hard as that is for me to admit. Let me just go ahead and let everyone know that most of this video was shot before the recent ATF opinion letter saying that we can once again shoulder SIG braces. And as a good law-abiding citizen, I would never shoulder a brace when it was in the opinion of the ATF that we couldn't on camera. That's why you see so many excellent cheek welds in the video. It's not, as, it. it's not as fun on the cheek. <laughs> Imagine that. So let's take a look at some of the features that make the APC-9 stand out in an increasingly crowded sub-gun market. I've already said that the ergonomics are unmatched and here's why. First off, full ambi controls on both sides of the gun you'll have a magazine release, bolt release, and safety. Also, all of these controls work well from either side of the gun, no sacrifices in function. You'll also find a bolt hold open button on the bottom just forward of the trigger guard. I really like the placement of everything and being able to hit the bolt release with your trigger finger is just so nice. Next up, the trigger, and that is phenomenal as well. Easily the best right out of the box sub gun trigger. Minus pulling at right about four and a half pounds, is silky smooth, and actually has a nice reset too. You really couldn't ask for more out of a trigger. The charging handle is reversible, so you can run it on either side of the weapon. I prefer mine on the left side of the gun, so I can charge the weapon with my left hand and maintain my sight picture. In fact, this is my definition of superior ergonomics. I can easily run the entire gun, drop the mag, release the bolt, charge the weapon, activate the safety, all without losing strong hand grip or sight picture. Plus, the APC-9 adds the ability to lock the bolt to the back. Mm -hmm. 
Now the charging handle does reciprocate with the bolt, and while I don't understand why, I know there are some people out there that hate this. I personally like it because should you have a malfunction, the charging handle also works as a forward assist. Malfunctions shouldn't be a big concern though. Round count on this gun is approaching 1300 and it's never been cleaned and never had a single malfunction. We also ran all kinds of different ammo, suppressed and unsuppressed, and it runs everything including the 165 grain hush that some guns just don't seem to like. This one just eats it up and asks for more. The size is so perfect. The gun feels so compact and light it is wonderful. The barrel length is 175 millimeters, which converts to about 6.8 inches. To give you a reference, that makes it smaller than a full-size MP5 and just bigger than an MP5K. All I can say is that it feels even more compact than the MP5K. It's just so small, light, and it feels perfect. It also gets even smaller when you fold the brace or stock, and it fits great into a backpack. This is the SBT brace from SB Tactical, and this is a very nice brace and complements the APC-9 very well. In fact, it looks just like the stock that would go on the APC-9 should you decide to short barrel it. The brace is hinged and is activated with this button, just like the real stock, just made out of a softer rubber while of course the stock is a hard plastic. This thing works great whether you decide to cheek weld it, wrap it around your forearm, or shoulder it because as of right now, we can do that again. One thing that I know some people complain about are the backup sights, but personally, I think it's great that they are included. Let's face it, if you have a gun like this, you're probably gonna run a red dot, and most good red dots won't let you down, but should that happen, you at least have something to work with. Plus, the design of the sight is completely unobtrusive the way they fold into the rail, and they don't take away from the sexy good looks of the APC-9. The construction of the APC-9 is nothing short of impressive as well. The Swiss attention to detail can be seen in all the superior machining on the inside of the aluminum upper, and the polymer construction of the lower is top notch as well. I also really like how the wear parts, like the feed ramp and the extractor in the upper, are replaceable. The polymer used by Brueger & Thomas is extremely rigid and strong with absolutely no flex. It just seems to be a little bit tougher than polymer used on other similar firearms. The APC-9 is a direct blowback system that is simple, efficient, and keeps the part count low. Disassembly is a breeze and somewhat AR-like. Just pop out these two captive pins to remove the lower. Tap or pull down on the rear section to remove. Pull the bolt carrier back to the takedown notch to remove the charging handle. The recoil spring helps hold the charging handle in, so you may need to slightly pull on that to remove it. Then the bolt will drop out the back. Pretty simple. I want you to take a look at the small spring in the back of the gun on the stock. This spring catches the bolt as it is moving backwards towards the shooter. And keep in mind that this is not the recoil spring. 
That would make me think that all the spring really does is dampen the felt recoil and just makes the APC-9 a dream to shoot with virtually no recoil. There are plenty of magazine options for the APC-9 and they come in 15 round, 20 round, and 30 round varieties. They are a translucent polymer, the magazines are very nice, super high quality, and load extremely smoothly like an HK. The magazines will also interchange with most of the other 9mm Bruger and Thomet guns. I happen to own a TP9, so it's nice to have the interchangeability. But they will also interchange with the P26 and the KH9 if you are lucky enough to own those guns. I know that they are on my wish list. Also, Steyr SPP magazines will work in the gun, and if you can find some of those, they can usually be had cheaper than the genuine Bruger and Thomet but they aren't translucent, just a solid black. Accuracy is just disgusting out of the APC-9. It makes it unbelievably easy to hit targets at 100 yards with a 9mm round. If you can't hit with this gun, I'm not sure that there's much hope for you, my friend. The insane accuracy coupled with the complete lack of recoil make this one of the most enjoyable guns to shoot, period. Like, not this week, not in recent memory, not this year, simply one of the most enjoyable guns to shoot ever. The quality and precision of this profound example of Swiss excellence can most readily be observed in the silky smoothness of the action. It's hard to put in words just how smooth the operation is, but I can tell you that it's even more evident when you suppress the APC-9. When suppressed, the APC-9 is remarkably quiet, and I feel much of that is due to the tight tolerances and precision built into the action. The gun basically makes no noise because the action is so smooth. Suppressors attached via 3-lug adapter, which is quick and easy. While I'm somewhat new to suppressors, 3-lug is quickly becoming my favorite method of attachment. So there's no getting around it, the APC-9 is expensive. So expensive, I remember thinking I better be damn impressed with this gun when I ordered one without ever having held one before. But thankfully I am. The gun is beyond any expectation that I could have had. But I know that there will be people out there saying I could buy three scorpions for that price. And to that I say, if you want three scorpions, please buy three scorpions. In fact, it would be great if you bought them from Gun Prime, link in the description. I'm not knocking the scorpion. I have one and think that it's great. But if you want what is as close to perfection as the subgun platform currently gets, this is it. I could really only come up with one major negative about the APC-9. And that is that it is so nice that it makes me want an APC-223 very badly. And that is unfortunate because my bank account is already on life support. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the video, go ahead and hit like, subscribe, and share it with your friends on your social media. If you want to help support Alabama Arsenal, check out the links in the description. Go to Brownells for all your firearms needs. Check out Grunt Style Clothing. They have some awesome t-shirts, and they're veteran owned, and it's just a great company to get behind. Check out Gun Prime. They have great deals on guns and accessories. And with the code ALARSENAL5 at Optics Planet, you can get 5% off of anything that you purchase. And be sure to follow us on Facebook and Instagram to see what we're currently working on. Thanks again for watching, guys.